the LGBTI community in Kenya, that is the lesbian, gay, bisexual, transsexual, intersex community in Kenya, uh, like in most of the world, are people who are not understood. You never realize how it hurts to be treated like a second class citizen in your motherland. This country is extremely homophobic. To feel helpless, broken, and shattered to the core. Some of the stories about gay and lesbian that get to the newspapers are always negative stories. Uh, so that when you think of a gay lesbian person, you don't think them you don't think about them first as a human being and secondly, as whatever they are. The trauma is already too big. Some of them commit suicide. Many do. Then there's violence against them, physical violence. There's nowhere you can voice your story. And so this idea was born by Internews on how we can train the LGBTI community. So that is what Internews did for, for us. They empowered us, they gave us skills that would enable us to report our own stories. Yeah, which is very powerful. After training, where is the outlet? Technology came in, and so we decided, let us t also train them how to retain our website. And we call this website uh, Freedom in Speech. We have a section of community that is not necessarily LGBTI identifying, but they will every morning visit the website to just see what is happening. That to us is positive, because we do not have to directly engage them on the streets or when we are having our protests, but they have this space where they can go and find out what exactly it is that we are doing and what our story is. One of the things that's also really important in Internews is to be able to build the capacity of local organizations to be able to tell their own stories and to go forward on their own. And it's been very, very gratifying for us to watch as this community has taken this space, has made it their own, and has been able to move forward to continue to tell their stories and to continue to reach all of Kenya and beyond. Uh, and that makes us very proud. It's kind of healing to them. And that way, you have saved, you have you have helped save a life.